Hello everybody, welcome to Visual Learning Portal where visuality conveys best. Today we are going to do chemistry. So something in chemistry we are going to do. So let's see the topic. So we have today matter, pure substance and mixture. So we're going to learn what is matter, what is a pure substance and what is a mixture. Okay, so a question in front of you, first of all, if you think about how many different substances are there? Around you, you need to see. Jo bhi aapke aas hai, jo bhi aap use karte ho, ya jo bhi aap normally life mein dekhte ho, wo kitni tarah ke hai? How many different substances can you think of? So kitne aap substances soch sakte ho ki humare aas paas hai? There are millions of different substances. For example, chair, table, floor, walls, light, so many things you can think of. Okay? So what are they made of? So basically question here pe arise hota hai. Matter to bhoat tarah ka hai. Kaafi cheeze hai humare paas. Jisko hum kehte hai matter. Okay? So basically what is a matter? So jitne bhi million substances aap sochte ho apni life mein ya dekhte ho. Un sab ko hum kya kehte hai? Ek matter ki form mein humne usko name diya hai. For example bucket hai. A bottle hai. Plastic bottle. Gloves hai. Form hai. Car. Rubber, glass. So these are the different kinds of things. ये कुछ examples मैंने pick करी हैं, कुछ pictures यहाँ पे मैंने add करी हैं, so that at least आपको example देके समझा सकूँ ताकि आपको पता लगे कि कितनी तरह की चीजें आप अपने आसपास normally देखते हो. For example, glass. Glass कितनी तरह के हैं? So this is a basically kind of different glasses. उसके ऊपर color किया हुआ है, so it's kind of a globe बनाया हुआ है. Rubber. Rubber is a kind of material. Okay. Similarly, आपके पास एक कार है कार बेसिकली कितने डिफरेंट एलिमेंट्स से बनी होती है सो बेसिकली सिलिकॉन है उसके अंदर बोरोन है एल्युमिनियम आयरन यू कैन थिंक ऑफ पीवीसी दैट इज द पॉलीथीन्स बेसिकली लेटेक्स है इस ग्लव्स के अंदर सो सिमिलरली द फॉर्म सो डिफरेंट काइंड्स ऑफ थिंग्स आर देयर सो बेसिकली व्हाट आर दे मेड अप ऑफ सो मेनी थिंग्स यू सी इन द लाइफ सो बेसिकली मैटर व्हाट इज द मैटर जैसे कि मैंने आपको बताया है कि ये सारी चीजें मैटर हैं what is that matter? So let's learn about the definition of that. Matter is anything that has a mass, jiska koi mass, mass ho, and takes up the space, jo koi ek space le. Agar hum usko kahi rakhenge, ya waise bhi agar wo cheez exist karti hai, agar usne koi uska mass hai, space hai, aur ya hum kahenge ki uska koi volume hai. Actually uska koi bhi, uska bhar hai, hum agar hum kahenge, that is called the matter. Matter can be classified as solid, liquid or gas. So solid ki form mein, liquid ki form mein, gas ki form mein, koi bhi cheez agar aapko available aap dekh sakte ho, to wo that is a matter. So there are different types of matter. Pure substance which is categorized into elements and compounds. And a mixture homogeneous and heterogeneous. So basically we will be going to do about these things in our further slides. And we will discuss about solid, liquids and gases in here. So you can see the three pictures, gas liquid and solid. So gas koi bhi ho sakti hai. It can be an oxygen, hydrogen, nitrogen. So many different of kind of gases. Air mein normally, atmosphere mein humare kaafi tarah ki gases exist karti hai. So that is a gas. So basically you can see the particles of the gas in the flask. Aap dekh sakti ho, ye kaafi zada idhar udhar hai. So that means ye evenly distribute nahi hai. Gas ke jo molecules hote hai, wo kahi jaga spread ho sakti hai. Similarly, if we talk about the liquid, if you see the particles of the liquid, evenly distributed near but still they are settled at the bottom. And solids, they are evenly distributed and also we can see the voids in between. So basically the space joske beach mein, that is called the void. Okay. So let's see. Matter is a pure substance and a mixture. So pure substance, it's easy to learn with the help of the flow charts. So flow charts ko learn kar loge, hamesha mind mein rakho ge, visually aap, aapko kabhi bhi ye bhule ga ki yes there was matter, there is a matter and having distributed into two substances that is pure substance and a mixture. Pure substance divide hota hai element or compound mein. Element, ek single element, it can be having a single type of atom, okay. Compound is a mixture of two. For example, agar yaha pe maine element ki aapko example deni hai. So here we know that element can be for example an oxygen element, an hydrogen element, an helium element, sodium element, chlorine element. So there are different kinds of elements which are all the pure substances. 
But if we talk about the compounds, so compounds is a mixture of many different kinds of elements. Can be one, can be, uh, can be two, can be three, can be four. So for example, for the compound, we have H2O, which is the water, is a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen. Hydrogen or oxygen ka mixture hota hai. So wo compound hamari wo compound ki form hai. So here aap dekh sakte ho, jo do red color hai, that is for the oxygen because that is for basically the hydrogen H2O and the one which is the gray part which is oxygen. Because one oxygen ka molecule, two hydrogen ke saath jab combine karta hai, to wo hamara compound hume deta hai. Similarly, NaCl which is the normal table salt we talk about. So for compound NaCl that is called the sodium chloride that is our normal table salt which we use normal salt in our food. Mein use karte Let's come here which we have mixture which is divided into two categories that is homogeneous mixtures and heterogeneous mixtures. So what are homogeneous mixtures? Homogeneous mixtures ki aap dekh sakte ho ki same kind of compound apas mein jude hue hai. Same elements ke alo aap inko same tarah ke apas mein jab jur jate hai. For example this one same category this is the same category and they are again same when they combine they form a homogeneous inko aap clearly dekh sakte ho ki yes that's a homogeneous but in heterogeneous there is a mixture they combine together in the form of form like that like a ke saath do jude hue hai so similarly this is a mixture of all the other compounds so now it's time to do in detail of these things so if you see in this slide and if I ask you, like, what is the similarity between these things? So, if you are getting, if you are getting, if you are getting, you can tell me in the comment box, ki, ye kya hai? what are I am talking about? So, you can see the gold plates here, you can see a piece of diamond, you can see some crystals or the glass here. So, what are these? So, you can tell me in the comment box, what is this? And here if we see that they are all the pure substances. Why? Because this is the gold. So gold hai ye, which is given by AU, which is the element symbol. This is a, basically a diamond or diamond hai hamare paas ye. So basically the form of the carbon. So carbon ki form hai, two forms hoti carbon ki, that's graphite and diamond. So this is the diamond. I, I, ye akela ek, ek hi piece hai. So basically the whole is made up of only one element which is a diamond. Similarly this is a glass or you can say a crystal which is made up of only one element. That's why ye sara ek hi cheez hai. That's why they call, call the pure substance. Okay. So basically that's the gold bar and whole is a gold in here. So they are called the pure substances. Similarly what you see here. आप अगेन कमेंट बॉक्स में मेरे को बता सकते हैं अगर आपको समझ में आ रहा है कि हम किस चीज के बारे में बात कर रहे हैं। So what is the similarity in here? So you can see a jug of juice and a glass, and similarly you can see there are so many lollies, and you can see some of the M&M gems which are very favorite for the children. Yeah. So यहाँ पे क्या है जो common है आपको यहाँ पे लग रहा है? So this is basically a mixture of so many things. So that is a sugar and a salt and there is a coating and also there is a some different material that has been used in here similarly for this one chocolates in there sugar in there and similarly in this one there is a liquid there is a lemon in here so you can see a few things in here and similarly hai kya? so kya similarity in some way so they all are the mixtures okay so they are also divided into further category jo ki humne flow chart mein dekha hai which is homogeneous and heterogeneous. Let's learn about these. Pure substances. A pure substance has a definite and a constant composition. Like salt or a sugar, a pure substance can be either an element or a compound. Ye cheez isme learn karne wali hai ki jo pure substance hai, wo two categories hai, elements and compounds. But the composition of a pure substance does not vary Pure substance composed of a single substance, one type of particle with the same properties throughout. So all over uski jo property hai, same rehti hai. Example, gold, silver and copper. Gold ka symbol AU, silver ka symbol AG and copper ka symbol CU. Okay, so here I have put a picture so that it will be more clear to you. Elements aap dekh sakte ho, helium atoms. So these are the different helium atoms. HE is the symbol for that. 
here you can see the oxygen molecule so basically two oxygen atom combine hoke kya form karte hain o2 which is oxygen gas or the oxygen molecule hum isko bol dete hain compound aap dekh sakte ho two hydrogen atom bonding with one oxygen atom so h plus h plus o which gives you h2o okay so ye iski ek picture hai That is a form of a picture. So दो H मतलब दो hydrogen के जो atom है आपस में combine करेंगे एक oxygen atom के साथ तो वो क्या बनाएंगे Water, which is H2O. So normal सो नॉर्मल है सिंपल एग्जाम्पल है ईजी टू रिमेंबर सो आप इजिली इसको याद कर सकते हो अगर आपको समझ में आ रहा है तो प्लीज मेरे को कमेंट बॉक्स में बताओ कि येस वी आर गेटिंग इट सो इजी टू रिमेंबर विद दी फ्लो चार्ट एंड द डेफिनेशन एन ऑल ऑल राइट नाउ लेट्स लर्न द डेफिनेशन विच इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट A mixture is a substance made by combining two or more different materials in such a way that no chemical reaction occurs. So basically, दो चीजों को हम combine करेंगे दो या दो से ज्यादा या तीन या चार उनको हम combine करेंगे Basically ये है कि इसके अंदर कोई chemical reaction नहीं होगी तो but still ये combine होंगे Examples के साथ आपको more clear हो जाएगा कि मैं क्या कह रही हूँ A mixture can usually be separated back into its original component. So basically, एक बार आप उसको mix कर दोगे तो आप उसको separate भी कर सकते हो So काफी process है separation के आप उस हिसाब से इसको separate भी कर सकते हो A mixture is a combination of two or more substances that are not chemically combined. जो मैंने यहाँ पे भी same चीज लिखी है but more clear wording में आपको समझ आएगा with each other and can be separated by physical means. So basically, आप उनको separate कर सकते हो One of the common example of mixture is air. So air is the normal atmosphere I'm talking about here, which is a homogeneous mixture, जो कि homogeneous है, gaseous substance है उसमें, like oxygen है, nitrogen है, hydrogen है, and smaller amount of other substances. Okay? So this is a basic definition of the mixture. Learn कर लो, बहुत easy है. So you can never forget mixtures. आप देख सकते हो सिमिलरली लॉलीज है यहाँ पे हाउ दे हैव बीन सेपरेटेड कलर का अगर डिफरेंट कलर्स हैं तो कलर आप सेपरेट कर लोगे तो इजी सिमिलरली आप घर में ये चीज कर सकते हो काफी सारी बॉल्स लो डिफरेंट कलर्स की उनको एक बैग में डालो मिक्स कर लो एंड आफ्टर दैट यू कैन ऑल्सो सेपरेट मिक्सचर बना के सेपरेशन हो गई ठीक है वट्स नेक्स्ट टाइप्स ऑफ मिक्सचर्स जैसे मैंने आपको ऑलरेडी बताया हेट्रोजीनियस एंड होमोजीनियस टू डिफरेंट फॉर्म्स हैं हेट्रोजीनियस मीन्स डिफरेंट Hetero different, hetero different, like that you can rhyme. Homogeneous means the same. Homo means same. Okay, so you can see the different parts, that's the different phases of the mixture easily in the hetero, and you cannot see the different parts, that is the different phases of the mixture in the homogeneous. So don't know separate, dif different, different है. So basically आप दोनों की definitions easily लिख सकते हो. So let's learn about the definitions of these. What is a homogeneous mixture? Homogeneous mixture are uniform composition. So here you can see that the uniform composition here, and similarly, if there is a tomato juice in here, so uniform है. आप कुछ बता नहीं सकते हो. एक tomato juice उन्होंने बनाया एक glass में. So you can't separate the things. Basically, you can't tell which component is where. So uniform composition, you can say for this one. वन फेज सो एक ही तरह का लग रहा है ऑल ओवर द ऑल ओवर थ्रू सो फ्रॉम बॉटम फ्रॉम द टॉप यू कैन सी सो दैट्स कॉल द वन फेज दैट अपीयर्स टू बी सेम थ्रू आउट स्मॉल पार्टिकल्स इवनली डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड सो यू कैन से दे आर इवनली डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड वेल मिक्सड द पार्टिकल्स दैट मेक अप द मिक्सचर वेरी स्मॉल एंड नॉट इजली रिकोगनाइजेबल सो बेसिकली इसमें डिफरेंट चीजें मिक्स करी हुई हैं so but easily recognizable नहीं है कि इसके अंदर क्या डला हुआ है so that's why they are called the homogeneous mixtures examples हैं salt water solution so salt को water में mix करोगे पानी में तो आप देखोगे कोई clear solution बन जाएगा that is homogeneous iodine vinegar 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 आपने normally घरों में देखा होगा stainless steel mixture of iron stainless जो steel के बर्तन वगैरह जो हमारे होते हैं वो normally क्या होता है mixture of iron क्रोमियम एंड निकल उनका मिक्स होता है बट नॉर्मली हम जब देखते हैं तो इट्स वी ऑलवेज से दैट इट्स स्टील ओनली ओके मिल्क टूथपेस्ट 
mayonnaise which we normally use for the sandwich and all etc so these are the examples of the homogeneous mixtures examples agar yaad hai aapko to aap straight away uski definition create kar sakte ho so basically the mixtures having the uniform composition having one phase and can be can seem like a small particles which evenly distributed okay now let's learn about the another definition which we have in here that is called the heterogeneous mixtures so definitely agar homogeneous aapko learn ho gayi hai ek hi phase hai to uska jo bhi opposite hai that is called the heterogeneous mixtures so heterogeneous mixtures here not evenly mixed so you can say koi kahan hai kuch kahan hai so that is not evenly mixed more than one phase so you can say different phases and here they are not some they are here green are here purple are there so it's just the way of representing that how they are basically mixed particles not uniformly distributed larger smaller so all different kinds of particles are in here easily separated physically physically of course it's really hard to separate this but yes we can do it aap isko pick karke colors alag kar sakte ho different cheeze alag kar sakte ho nuts alag kar sakte ho similarly aap lollies alag kar sakte ho examples salt and pepper cereals rocks bag of assorted candies sand and pebbles aap alag kar sakte ho oil and water etc so these are the different kind of mixtures homogeneous or heterogeneous mixtures ko learn kar lo pictures yaad kar lo to similarly aap easily isko dekh sakte ho ki kya hai iske andar aur hamesha aapko definition yaad ho jayegi if you can remember the picture all right If you like the video please don't forget to subscribe and please hame comment box mein bataye aapko kaisa laga aur agar aapko koi aapka topic hai jiske liye aapko more explanation chahiye hai to aap hame bata sakte hai so that we can make the powerpoint according to your demand all right thanks for watching visual learning portal any questions comment below and we'll respond as soon as possible don't forget to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to be notified when we release new content We'll keep posting as much as we can. Thanks for watching.